the exact way that these viruses end up infecting people is still a little bit of a mystery. I mean, clearly, these are largely farm animals that we're talking about, and so there are lots of opportunities for people to be in contact with them. But the exact event where someone went to a farm or was working on a farm and got infected by a bird or a backyard flock, oftentimes we don't really know exactly when that happened. Now, the important question is, these events take place all the time. But those viruses usually only cause a single case. They don't then spread from the first person to the next person. And a really critical question is, why not? What are the factors that limit these infections to just the person who got it from the bird and prevent them from spreading from person to person?